NASA's Voyager 1 spacecraft, currently the farthest human-made object from Earth, has fascinated people across the globe for nearly five decades. Since its 1977 launch, it has transmitted invaluable data from the edge of deep space, vastly expanding our understanding of the cosmos. However, its recent transmissions have shown strange anomalies, baffling scientists and sparking debates. Are these simply technical malfunctions, or could they be signs of something more mysterious, perhaps even extraterrestrial? Join us as we investigate these puzzling signals and ponder what secrets may lie hidden in the vastness of space. Humanity's enduring drive to solve mysteries has long fueled our journey into the unknown. This deep curiosity led to bold missions like Pioneer 10 and 11, which were among the most daring space expeditions of their time. Voyager 2 lifted off from NASA's Kennedy Space Center on August 20, 1977, ushering in a new era of space exploration. Just weeks later, on September 5, 1977, Voyager 1 was launched, embarking on a path past the outer planets that would reshape scientific thinking. Weighing around 721 kilograms, similar to a small car, both spacecraft traveled unique trajectories at different speeds. A key milestone occurred on December 15, 1977, when Voyager 1 surpassed its twin in distance, thanks to its faster course. From that point on, Voyager 1 became a crucial tool in unveiling the mysteries of the universe, offering discoveries that changed our perception of space. Before diving into its latest intriguing transmissions, let's revisit some of Voyager 1's most iconic achievements. In 1979, while 265 million kilometers from Earth, the probe captured high-resolution images of Jupiter. Over a 100-hour period, it created a time-lapse video of the planet's rotation using 3,750 images, offering unprecedented views of Jupiter's churning atmosphere. During this mission, Voyager 1 discovered a previously unseen ring around the planet and two new moons, major contributions to our knowledge of Jupiter's complex system. To safely navigate past Saturn's moon Titan, the spacecraft performed several crucial course corrections. After its planetary encounters, Voyager 1 shifted its focus toward interstellar space, moving at an astonishing pace of 325 million kilometers per year. By January 1990, it had begun its interstellar mission in earnest. One of its most remarkable achievements came on February 14, 1990, when it captured the legendary family portrait, a mosaic of 60 images showing the inner planets from about 6 billion kilometers away, including the iconic pale blue image of Earth. Meanwhile, Voyager 2 was achieving its own groundbreaking milestones. It recorded Neptune's wind speeds, over 2,100 kilometers per hour, about 1,300 meters per second, the fastest atmospheric winds ever observed in our solar system. It also studied Neptune's moon Triton, where temperatures plunged to minus 391 degrees Fahrenheit, making it one of the coldest places known. Triton's surface revealed icy geysers that erupted nitrogen gas and frozen particles up to 5 kilometers high, showcasing a geologically active world. Together, Voyager 1 and 2 revolutionized our understanding of the solar system, revealing that even distant moons once considered inert could harbor dynamic, surprising phenomena. Their discoveries have reshaped scientific assumptions. And now, as Voyager 1 sends back strange new signals, we're left wondering what other secrets may still be waiting to be uncovered beyond the stars. Earlier theories about planetary geology were revolutionized by Voyager 2, which made history as the only spacecraft a day to conduct close-up visits to both Uranus and Neptune, an achievement that remains unmatched. NASA extended the lifespans of the Voyager missions through ingenious energy-saving measures, such as shutting down non-essential systems. These iconic missions are expected to continue until around 2030, marking the end of a remarkable era for the dedicated teams behind them. Voyager 1 and 2 were engineering marvels, designed to rotate slowly, they minimized image blurring during movement. Even before reaching the outer planets, they began sending back stunningly detailed images of Jupiter, capturing features like its swirling cloud bands and the Great Red Spot, a massive, long-lived storm that has fascinated scientists for decades. One of the most thrilling discoveries came when Voyager detected volcanic activity on Io, one of Jupiter's moons. The spacecraft instruments picked up unusual readings 
which were later confirmed by images showing enormous volcanic plumes and a surface dramatically reshaped by eruptions. One eruption was estimated to be 1,000 times more powerful than the Mount St. Helens blast, covering an area nearly the size of France. As the probes continued their journeys, NASA gradually powered them down to preserve energy for their extended mission into interstellar space. Notably, neither spacecraft captured images of Mercury or Mars due to technical limitations. However, NASA followed up with additional landmark missions, including Pioneer 10, Pioneer 11, and New Horizons. On February 17, 1998, Pioneer 10 surpassed Pioneer 11 to become the most distant probe from Earth, though Voyager 1 would eventually surpass them all. On August 25, 2012, after 14 more years of travel, Voyager 1 officially entered interstellar space. A key factor in the success of these missions was the use of gravitational slingshot maneuvers. Rather than relying solely on fuel, the spacecraft used the gravity of planets like Jupiter and Saturn to boost their speed and alter their trajectories. These maneuvers allowed them to cover immense distances while conserving energy. For example, as Voyager 1 approached Jupiter, the planet's gravity accelerated the spacecraft significantly. Precision calculations were essential to ensure the right trajectory and avoid potential risks. Similarly, Voyager 2 used the gravity of Jupiter and Saturn to reach Uranus and Neptune, proving the effectiveness of this navigation strategy. Looking back on these extraordinary missions, scientists continue to analyze the unusual signals recently transmitted by Voyager 1. Despite its vast distance from Earth, the probe remains operational, collecting data from the fringes of our solar system. It has provided invaluable insights into the outer planets, Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, and Neptune. Voyager 1 captured time-lapse sequences, revealing 10 volcanic eruptions on Jupiter, discovered new moons, and detected an unknown ring around the planet, dramatically enhancing our understanding of the Jovian system. It also identified four additional moons of Saturn, Mimas, Enceladus, Tethys, and Rhea, and transmitted breathtaking images of the planet and its rings, offering new perspectives on its structure and composition. The flybys of Uranus and Neptune delivered essential data about their atmospheres and moons, greatly expanding our knowledge of the solar system's distant realms. Once their planetary missions were complete, the probe set a course for interstellar space, where they continue to transmit critical scientific data from beyond our solar neighborhood. As we await new revelations from Voyager 1's enigmatic signals, their ongoing mission remains a source of inspiration for scientists and space enthusiasts alike. These historic spacecraft have not only transformed our understanding of the cosmos, but have also expanded the boundaries of human exploration, leaving behind a legacy of iconic images and groundbreaking discoveries that continue to shape space science. Voyager Achievements and Legacy The Voyager spacecraft were not just scientific pioneers. They also carried a profound cultural message from humanity. Each probe included the iconic golden record, a time capsule meant to communicate the story of Earth to any intelligent extraterrestrial life it might encounter. This record features greetings in 55 languages, music from around the world, and natural sounds like rain and whale calls, a symbolic gesture hope that future civilizations may one day discover and understand it. Scientifically, Voyager 1 and 2 were equipped with a sophisticated array of instruments that revolutionized our understanding of the solar system. These tools included magnetometers, plasma wave sensors, and imaging devices that collected invaluable data on space environments. The magnetometers revealed the complex magnetic fields of outer planets and how they interact with their surroundings. Plasma sensors help scientists study the effects of solar wind on planetary atmospheres. One of the mission's greatest contributions was the mapping of the heliosphere, the vast, bubble-like region dominated by solar particles and magnetic forces that surrounds our solar system. As Voyager 1 neared this frontier, it recorded a transition from particles of solar origin to those of interstellar space, offering compelling evidence of how this boundary helped protect Earth from harmful cosmic radiation. The spacecraft also detected the termination shock, where solar wind slows dramatically and becomes denser. Beyond that lies the heliosheath, a turbulent zone where solar and interstellar matter collide, creating a dynamic plasma environment. Voyager 2 added further depth to our understanding of these distant regions. Its measurement of Uranus's dramatically tilted magnetic field defied earlier models, 
and open new avenues of research into planetary magnetism. Beyond their scientific breakthroughs, the Voyager missions capture the public's imagination. The stunning images of distant planets, such as Saturn's intricate rings and Jupiter's swirling great red spot, remain some of the most iconic visuals in space exploration history. Together, the Voyagers not only expanded our knowledge of the cosmos, but also left an enduring legacy of curiosity, creativity, and connection with the universe.